Okay. So Barbie has some new stuff going on. She's loving a good nail look lately. And we have to try it, obviously. Obviously. I let my nails grow out. And so they're ready to go. Here we go, DIY nail art designs tutorial. Five easy ideas. Hey everyone, how are you? Hey. I'm so good. Actually, if I'm being honest, Barbie, I'm not doing too great. I've just been um, really tired the past few days. I'm trying to get more motivation to do things. I love playing with, with my dog, but that's about a it. A guy you know, like, who lives, you know, he could live in Alaska for all I know. I, I don't know. How are you? So, do you remember when I started this vlog? Like, way, 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 way back? Yeah, we all remember. Definitely remember. Well, it occurred to me that I have never done a nail art DIY vlog. A nail art DIY vlog. Are you kidding me? Girl, we're ready. I'm gonna teach you how to do some really cool nail designs. And I just love how the colors of the nail polishes on her table, we probably will not use one of those colors. Cause they just put random colors on the table. I just got the bare basics here. Oh, and remember that you should always ask an adult or parents for help in dealing with nail polish because that can get really messy really fast. No mom, I don't need to have mom. No, I don't need my mom's help, Barbie. Okay. I could be a mom at this point. You know, if I wanted to. Also, I really don't know what age I want to have kids. want them right now. But what if I... But I haven't met anyone that I want to have kids with. And that has to be the first And step. I'm not really looking, honestly. Just, that's just how I feel on the subject. The first step for any nail design is the base coat color. Wait. Color. <laughs> Okay, so I have this natural nail strengthener, the OPI nail polish. So I'm gonna put that first layer on there. My nails are so bad. Like if y'all saw my cuticles, if y'all saw, I've talked about this before, it's the upkeep. I can't, I can't do it, I can't. Like I'd rather, waste all my money on Starbucks than on acrylics, and that's just me. <laughs> now let's see what the first Barbie nail design is. <laughs> For any- I call it the thumb. I love this one. I'm using white as my base color. Then, take your favorite color of nail polish. I'm going to use pink, <laughs> obviously. First, like my cuticles on my thumbs is so, it goes like, <laughs> First we're gonna do this white. I think this is dry. Yeah, this dries real quick because it's good stuff. This was like that 97 cent. This one's called hard to get. And then the other one's called hard bitten. They love the hard. Hello. Oh, this is gonna take forever to dry. Ma'am, I should have gotten one of those dryer things. I think I have one, but it broke. They have these things where you can like stick your fingers on her and it dries them. It's basically literally just a fan. So there's white. Look at my, like, I think that's why I won't go to a nail place is because I'm afraid if I go, they're gonna be like, get out. And put a drop on some paper. Next, put your thumb in the polish like this. Oh, that's a drip, drippy drip. It's like a whole puddle. It's like, poof. How do you get it off your finger? It's just gonna be like all over your finger, too. Okay, well, I have some paper. Okay. And roll it over your nails. And it looks like this. Like you have fingerprints on your nails. And it looks like this. It's like you have not. fingerprints. It's not gonna look like that. Like they're making it look like it's gonna be like little swirlies. Little swirlies. This one's called Love Rocks. 
I feel like I should like spread it out. Ooh, okay, let's try it again. Hmm. It looks like a crime scene. Like if this was red, it wouldn't look okay. The next nail design we're going to learn is called the newspaper. Renee taught me this one. Who's Renee? She's acting like we all should know who Renee is. I'm sure it's one of her BFFs. Paint your nails a light base color. Get a small glass of water. Put your finger in the water to make it wet. Yeah. Ooh, and it's sparkly. This is more like a translucent. I learned what opaque meant way too late in life. Then cut a small piece of newspaper or a magazine print like this and carefully press it on the nail for a beat. For a beat? Hey, huh. that's kind of cool. Y'all on beat. Barbie, you really starting everything good in this world. Well, at least it's dry. No, it's not dry. Dear patience. Then carefully roll it off. You don't want to smudge it. That made it sound like it's going to rip off. It went. And let your finger dry. And voila, your nails are like tiny magazine stories. Um, So that's literally just like photoshopped onto her fingers. <laughs> It's not like she's animated in the first place, but it's photoshopped on her fingers. It's not even real. So I don't have a newspaper. I guess I'll just use some of this with like the words on it, see if that works. So instead of like a newspaper clipping, we're gonna have items purchased at JCPenney are eligible for exchange or refund of the purchase price on the original method of payment. Some rules apply, shipping charges and non-refundable with this. Okay. So I'm gonna dip my finger. Dip. And then hold on hold. It got on there a little bit. I'm gonna get that 1855. We gotta get a phone number on there. What if you like put your phone number on your nails? People are like, what's your number? And you're like, that didn't work, didn't work. Um, so yeah. Your nails are like tiny magazine stories. Yes! Next nail design is called polka dots. Polka dots! Okay, this one be fun. I love polka dots. This one feels really festive. Take any light nail polish as your undercolor. This to help make the lines of simple polka dots. Okay, so I have this light blue color. This one's called Hard Bitten. I feel like that would be a red color, but I don't know. Maybe I'm just too obsessed with Twilight because that's my personality trait now. I used to like absolutely despise nail polish when I was a kid. I remember one time. I went to a sleepover and like we all got our nails done. That night I was sleeping in my sleeping bag. Or I wasn't sleeping. I was peeling off all of the nail polish before I woke up. By the next morning all of it was gone because I just hated the feeling of it so much. So that was me as a child. So we have all the bases. Strike. Then I use the tip of a bobby pin like this to help make a line of simple polka dots on the edge of the nail. I like to use random bright colors like this. Okay, these are like off-brand bobby pins so the ends don't even have that little dot thing at the end. <laughs> so it's just gonna be like metal, just a metal little slab. And then we'll kind of put some dots. Not the dots getting bigger as I go. So next I'm gonna show you some lines. I use a white polish as the undercoat and colored polishes to make the lines on the nails like this. I think this look is really fun and playful. I thought she was about to say fun and fresh and I was like, same. I say fun and fresh. Guess we could use like orange. I think that'd be kind of cute. I'll show you all the dots and the lines at the same time. It's gonna be epic. Okay, if I did my nails, I would do it like that. Ew. Um, All right, so here are these two. I'm not gonna flip you off. I wouldn't necessarily call that a line. But and you know 
me? I can't end this tutorial without hearts. I start with a light pink nail, then use dark red for the heart, but you can use any color you want. No, we like dark red because it's, you know? I really hope you liked these nails. I did, even though we're not done. I feel like dark red is just very classy, a little bit more mature. Start with three dots like this, then join the dots like this into a small heart. It's a little heart. It looks like Mickey Mouse. Here's the finished product. liked these nail designs, they're some of my faves. Progress, not perfection. We can be really hard on ourselves sometimes, right? Especially when we're learning something new. Progress, not perfection. perfection. And I can't wait to see how your nail designs turn out. Hey. You know, I can't wait either. <sighs> She's so inspirational, I love her.